Welcome back. It's P and T with T Taught 2. We wanted to get more of you in the show, so we asked a bunch of folks to join us for a trick from Fool Us Trophy winner and master magician Joshua J. Hey, Josh, how you doing? I'm well, Penn. Thanks very much. And you can actually start us off. I need somebody totally at random, so I want you to choose anybody you want from this video conference. Okay, no, I don't have names on the screens, so I have to go with someone that I can describe easily. I think there's only one person wearing a hoodie, a uh, red hoodie that I can see the strings on. What's your name, please? My name is Jaden. Jaden, let's use Jaden. Hi, Jaden. Listen, How's it going? this is a tape measure, but it's also a prediction. Before this video conference, I got a premonition. It wasn't about something you'd think of or your name. It was about a height. This is my prediction. So, Jaden, for the first time, to the inch, how tall are you? I'm six foot two inches. Six foot two? Yes. That's interesting. Because you see, on this tape measure, you can see the inches and you can see the feet. This is uh, four feet, this is five feet, and this is six feet. And that, my friend, is six feet two, a perfect X at six feet two. I want you to be able to see six foot two perfectly predicted. And that's pretty interesting. I would say so too. That's a great trick, Joshua. Really great trick. Now you promised you are gonna show everybody at home how to do it. So spit it out. How do we do it? Yeah, so there's actually a really interesting way to look at the way magicians think. Because we have this saying in magic that if I can get you to ask the wrong question, They'll never come up with the right answer. Now, if you're asking, how did we know that Penn would pick Jaden, or how did I know that Jaden would be six foot two, that's the wrong question. Maybe you think, oh, I know how he did it. Everybody in this video conference is the same height. Well, that's possible. Let's check. I'm gonna, I'm gonna bust you on this. Bring everybody back. I wanna see if everybody's six two. First of all, just by nodding your heads, uh, is everybody six two? Is that the height you are? Okay. How did you do it, Josh? The secret of the trick is a dry erase marker. I'm gonna mark every height that could possibly be named between about four foot 10 and six foot seven, especially if Penn Gillette is in the room. So I'll just put a bunch of X's on here as an example. And now you're ready to perform. When you're ready to do this trick, you ask anybody to name their height, and it really doesn't matter what they say, because when you pull it out, you place your thumb on top of the tape of the tape measure. So let's say he says he's 5'6". I pull it out to 5'6", and when I start erasing with my thumb, I am just erasing the X's until I get through 5'5", then I stop and lift over to 5'6", which is 66 inches. Now, of course, you've got a problem. The X's go all the way up. How do we get rid of those X's? The way you get rid of them is you say, is that your height, 5'6", with those X's exactly the right spot? And is that the only X on the tape measure? And you simply erase all the other X's. And then you're left with an examinable tape measure and a miracle nobody can. An absolute miracle that you can do easily. No practice. And you can hand the tape measure out. That's amazing. Thank you all so much for helping us out here. Thank you, Jaden, for being 6'2". Thanks to the rest of you for not being 6'2". And uh, Josh, how, how'd you get the X on Teller's forehead? You wanna explain that later? Anyway, Joshua J, let's hear it for him. Great trick.